America's Got Talent winner, Terry Fader and his cast of America's Favorite Puppets. They're coming to our area, the Paramount Arts Center, with the new version of your Las Vegas show, Terry Fader, on the road again. Terry, so great to see you, and you have one of your friends with you, too. I do, yes, and we're very excited to be coming there with On the Road Again, and, and actually another name for the show is Who's the Dummy Now? And we all know looking at Terry who the dummy is, right? <laughs> oh my goodness, we can We're so wait. glad to be there. It's, it's gonna be, oh, thank you. It's going to be so exciting. It's our first show of the new year. We uh, ended our, our um, Christmas shows on December 30th, and now we've taken a few, uh, few days off, and oh, I'm so excited. I can't wait to get back on stage. Me neither. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you all are so fun to watch. But how did you even get started in this? It's not like, you know, there are dance studios everywhere, soccer leagues for little kids. How did you get into being a ventriloquist? Well, uh, the, we, I was hanging at the pond. No, she was talking to me. Oh, sorry, sorry. Yeah, 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 no. uh, so, so let me talk. Okay. okay. So uh, I found a book in my school library, and it was uh, How to Be a Ventriloquist. It was actually Ventriloquism for Fun and Profit by uh, Paul Winchell. I checked the book out, took it home, and learned that he could talk like this without moving his lips. Hey, that was pretty good. I know. I've been wow. practicing. Yeah. <laughs> so I just I just worked at home with, a, I got a little puppet at Sears. Um, and wait, you got a puppet? I do. I love puppets. Me too. <laughs> and so I, I got a puppet at Sears and started doing little shows. And then uh, I got a, a semi-professional puppet on my 18th birthday. I got my, I got my first real professional ventriloquist dummy. And uh, he will be, yeah, he's going to be in the show. Yeah, he's very funny. Not as funny as me, but he's funny. Right. <laughs> Walter Dierdo. <laughs> He'll be there. Oh, my goodness. Okay. So, we know you've had a successful show on the Las Vegas Strip. So, is your touring show different? What are we in for? Well, it's it's the same show, and that's the, the beautiful thing. This is the show that I'm doing in Vegas, but I'm writing a brand new show for it. So in a couple of months, it's going to be totally different. But this is actually it's the very first time I've actually taken material that I've done in Las Vegas that you cannot that you have been not been able to see. Um, some new stuff too. I mean, so even if you've seen the show, you're going to love it. But it's it's very much I'm bringing Las Vegas to to you. So you just got to go and see me at the Paramount. It's going to be incredible. Well, that sounds fun. Okay, now I hear there are going to be a few celebrity puppet guests in your show who can we expect to see and will any of them be singing well yes uh, in my in my show now if you look on my YouTube and, and on my socials you can find uh, look see if I can move over and show you there's Michael Jackson and Justin Bieber oh wow well, they're not talking. no they're not talking so I'm not with them they're in they're on my YouTube and socials but in my live show you'll be able to see um, puppets of Frank Sinatra and you'll be able to see Kenny uh, uh, oh, no Kenny Kenny uh, Willie Nelson oh Willie Nelson yeah and he'll be singing so we have celebrities but we also have a, the world's greatest Elvis impersonator oh he's very funny and very good. Well, thank you. Yeah, yeah. I didn't compliment you. I complimented Maynard. That's true. He did. <laughs> you know, winning. You'll America's... see lots of great stuff. It's gonna be... Good. I'm sorry. Go ahead. Good. We <laughs> cannot wait. So you know, winning America's Got Talent really put you on the map. Are you involved with AGT? Do you keep in touch, uh, even with some of the past winners? I do. Yes. Yes. Darcy Lynn and I. Uh, regularly talk to each other, and I, I, uh, I'm very good friends with their parents. I'm, uh, I'm good friends with uh, some of the other people that, that were on the season that I was on. Uh, I, I regularly speak with Simon Cowell. I watch the show, love the show. Uh, not a part of the new Fantasy League, but I was a part of the All-Stars that, uh, that was earlier in 2023. Um, so it's just, it's just an exciting uh, place to be. And, of course, it did change my life. I mean, I was playing schools in elementary, uh, elementary schools and, and county fairs uh, up until <laughs> I was able to win. America's Got Talent, and then suddenly, kabam, I was a, uh, a headliner in Vegas. Been there for 17 years this year. Wow. I didn't know you were that old. I am. <laughs> <laughs> that is amazing. Congratulations. And we are so excited that you're going to be in our area with all your friends, and that's going to be at the Paramount in Ashland, Kentucky. Looking forward to it. Terry, it's been so fun talking to you and your, uh, your, um, your sidekick there. You all have you all have a lot Thank of uh, you. good chemistry. You'll be able to see <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. You'll see him live on stage. Yes, I'll be there live. You don't want to miss it. <laughs> oh, oh my goodness, we cannot wait. Lots of fun. Can't wait to see you when you come to town.
How cute. Okay, so Terry Fader and all of his buddies on the road again will be at the Paramount Arts Center. The show is set for this Friday, January 10th, I mean 12th, January 12th. Doors open at 7 o'clock and that show begins at 8. So there you go. <laughs> what a talent. I'm always impressed yes. that he can do that. Yeah. And not even, like you don't even see him move his mouth. Oh, And he said he just, you know, got a book out of his school library, bought a puppet at Sears, and that's what started his career. Right. <laughs> He's funny. That'll be a he good He really show. is.